welcome to Lavanya's computer classes. In this video, I will explain typecasting. Typecasting in C language, it is PPS programming for problem solving for JNTH R22 or R18. It is very, very important concept. So, what is typecasting or type conversion? So, the processing of converting one data type into another data type is called as typecasting. So, what is the different uh, definition of uh, typecasting means the process of converting. The process of converting one data type into another data type is called as typecasting. For example, we write like this int a different different data types are available in C language. One is the integer for example, we declare the variable like this int a equal to 10. Then float, float is one more data type float b. So, there are two variables are there one is the variable a second one is the variable b. A is which data type means A is the integer data type, its value is 10. And I declared one more variable that is B, B is a flow data type. After that, I assign like this, this is the assignment operator, B equal to A. What is B equal to A means the variable A is assigned to the variable in B. So, that means now after that, B equal to, what is the value of B means? Value, value of B is value of A, value of A is stored into the b that means now printf what is printf printf is uh, print statement printf percentile f because b you want to print that value like this that means a is actually integer number now integer number wants to store it in the flow data type that means one data type is converted into another data type this is called as type conversion so, what is type conversion or type casting means the process of converting one data type into another data type is called as type casting or type conversion. Again, the difference is there for type casting and type conversion. In this video, we will explain difference between type casting and type conversion also. So, how many types of conversions we have? Been? There are two types of conversions are there. One is implicit conversion, implicit data type conversion. And second one is explicit type conversion. Implicit conversion is done by the automatically like this in this example. And uh, explicit conversion you have to done using some operator external you have to do. Then only it is called as explicit type conversion. So, implicit conversion is automatically done it is called as promotion. Why it is called as promotion means because smaller data type is converted into larger data type. Small values are stored into larger data type that is what is called as promotion. Explicit type conversion means larger data type is stored into tries to store it in the smaller data type. Bigger one is stored into smaller data type that is what is called as demotion. For explicit conversion is done by the user. And implicit conversion is done by the compiler, automatic conversion. <coughs> so, here this is the notes. In this, I will explain what is the type conversion. Here, type casting or type conversion. Type casting or type conversion is a process of converting one data type into another data type. How many types of conversion we have? I mean, there are two types of conversions. One is implicit type conversion, second one is explicit type conversion. Now, go for what is implicit type conversion. Implicit type conversion means the conversion is also called as automatic type conversion. Why it is called as automatic type conversion means because uh, automatically compiler itself, compiler only converting automatically without using, uh, without asking user automatically at the time of compile time only it converted. That compiler performs conver conversion at the time of compiler automatically. This conversion is used to convert, it is important, smaller data type into larger data type. Whenever any smaller data type is stored into larger data type, automatically compiler only converting this type of conversion that is called as implicit type conversion. So, this is the diagram you have to check it. This is the different types of data types. This is the first one is smallest data type is boolean. You have check it from here to here. Boolean data type, then character data type, both are occupies only one byte. 
after that short data type then int data type in this int only different types of ints are there unsigned int then long int unsigned long int then float double long double these are the different types of data types are available according to their bytes so shortest one smallest one is boolean and character data type so here whenever the smallest data type character character or boolean convert into short or integer or up to long double like this in this flow this is called that means shortest data type is converted into larger data type that is called as promotion which type of conversion that is called means that is called as implicit conversion who is doing this conversion means compiler only the user is not doing anything automatically compiler only converting the smaller data type into larger data type that is called as promotion if we are converting the larger data type into smaller like this higher data type into smaller data type that is called as demotion <coughs> that means officer who higher post officer is again demoting and join as a, like a clerk or something that is called as demotion if the clerk clerk is going to higher position like officer that is called as promotion so exp uh, any larger data type stored into the smaller data type that is explicit conversion that is called as demotion now we'll go for example for implicit conversion who is doing the implicit conversion means compiler only so here this is the programming hash include stdiver.h hash include conio.h void main then i will take two variables one is the variable name a another variable name is b one is integer one is float so according to this short um, this chart int is the smaller data type compared to float data type see here this is the int data type this is the float data type so which one is small means integer is smaller data type compared to float data type after that i gave the value for a a equal to 10 integer data type b equal to a what is the meaning of this one means the variable a is stored into variable b but which one is the smaller data type means a is the smaller data type and b is the larger data type so a smaller data type a is stored into b that means smaller data type wants to store it in the larger data type this is called as promotion promotion means implicit conversion print of percentile b means automatically b value is printed here we are not use any operator any different types of operator automatically compiler only converting this so this is example for implicit type conversion now we go for explicit type conversion explicit type conversion means this is also called as type casting in the beginning only i said type casting and type conversion so what is type conversion means converting smaller data type into larger data type is called as type conversion type casting means larger data type is converted into smaller data type is called as type casting here who is you converting means compiler is not compiling not converting user only it is a user defined conversion user only converted the larger data type into smaller data type whenever the larger data type is converting into smaller data type is called as explicit type conversion here we have to you only define how to convert it so here we need syntax expression and before that we have to write which in which data type we have to convert it okay so this is the example hash include stdiver.h hash include conio.h void main here i am taking float variable x that is the value is 1.2 next one is integer y here integer data type is a smaller data type compared to float okay here x value is already there what is the x value here x value is 1.2 it is a float data type that means it is the larger data type now i'll take one more variable integer y now i want to store the larger data type he like this larger data type into smaller data type whenever the larger data type wants to store the smaller data type 
compiler has not do anything explicitly user only converting using explicit type conversion how we are converting means see here y is the shorter data type so int y equal to now we want to convert it into x but x is a flow data type larger data type now it is converted into smaller data type in which data type we are writing like this we have to write that means this small larger data type now we treat it like a shorter data type integer so this is called as explicit type conversion so print y means y is printed so this is the example for explicit type conversion very very important question in pps read all the statements what is type conversion types of type conversions and difference between type casting and type conversion thank you for watching my video please subscribe my channel thank you